All right, you know, one local business owner is taking uh, his services all outside by creating a safe place for guests. Julius Ortiz live at Glam Brows and Aesthetics with more. Your, your brows are looking fabulous. Julissa. They look good. Who? No, do not look closely. Do not look closely, okay? <laughs> I need to get my brows did. Let me tell you. Hey, you guys, we're right here on Capitol between 19th and 20th, right? They've got so many great restaurant spots to check out. But what I love is that you can also get your brows done. Yes. Yeah, as you know, a lot of salons, they were shut down, they got to open, they shut down again, and now some people are taking their services, including Mr. Trevin here. We've got Glam Brows and Aesthetics right here. Isn't this a beautiful space? Take a look around. I mean, the fire pit and everything. Trevin, air high five to you. This is fantastic. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> the space is usually inside. You have been here for about three years. Correct. Um, but talk a little bit about, you know, you had to close back in March mm -hmm. and then you got to open. Talk a little bit about what these last few months have been like. The last few months have been pretty rough. Yeah. Um, you know, we've been closed. We were able to open for about six days yeah. uh, and then we had to shut back down again. Mm -hmm. And we recently got the okay to be outdoors. Yeah. So, so, so you heard that and you're like, well, let's check. You said you've never really spent time in this space, correct. but man, it's working. It is indeed. <laughs> and clients seem to love it, which has been great. Yeah. yeah. Now you normally offer what kinds of services and what, which, what has changed? We mainly offer, offer uh, facial waxing, but now we are only doing brow waxing for the time being. Yeah. Um, and yeah, so far so good. It's been great. Mm -hmm. We of course appreciate our models here this morning. All right, so let's talk with some about some of the protocols because yeah. while this is beautiful and lovely, we are also still being very safe. Obviously, you and Corinne, uh, the other esthetician there, is um, wearing a face mask as well. But here's a list of things. So if you are looking to come get your brows did, um, some things that you people need to know when they do make an appointment. Right. We are doing temperature checks mm -hmm. um, right upon arrival. We are doing sanitation, hand sanitizer right when you come in the doors yeah. as well. Um, and face masks are required too. Right, right. And as far as are, you're just doing the two and and you must make an appointment, obviously. Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. And texting is usually the best way to make appointments. We also have our Instagrams that I you yeah. know, gave you the names of. Um, that's usually the best way. Um, I'm really loving this fire pit, Thank but <laughs> we are in the summer, and <laughs> right. so it has been hot these it's last few. in the morning. Right? <laughs> <laughs> these last few days have been very hot. So how has the heat taken a role? Has, has that in, impacted the services at all? Luckily, it has not. Mm -hmm. um, we have a lot of shade here, yeah. and I tend to take my lunch breaks at the hottest <laughs> point of the day. Yes. So you know, <laughs> clients appreciate that, yes. and so it's been working. That is fantastic. A lot of your clients are coming back. You said they are. Yes, That's and they're. I feel like. Like they feel pretty safe here, mm -hmm. you know, being outdoors with the fresh air. So it's been good. That is good. So again, you said it's also very easy. You said they roll out their their tray exactly. with all of their stuff. And again, uh, you were just inside. You said you've been here for about three years. Yes, correct. All right. Yes. Well, Trevin, we appreciate your time this morning. Well done on getting creative. So many Thank businesses you. have had to get creative, right, to modify their services. I'm just going to plant myself right here, and that way, when you're done with them. I hope you didn't to look too closely at my brows. But anywho, there you go. <laughs> right? I mean, isn't this fabulous? I just want to get it's great. Out of here. nice and who it you know. The, <laughs> it's not just for the ladies. Uh, some guys like to get their uh, their their male uh, grooming done as well. And I've been there out there. So right. I told you, Reb, and I said hello. <laughs> <laughs> I I know, I know. You I mean your brows are better than mine. I will be the first to tell you that. <laughs> Jordan, should we discuss so, yeah, uh, what services you, you had done there? You, you, <laughs> they, 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 they do great brows and I've also done the uh, the nose. As That's well. what we're talking about. <laughs> hey, I'm not embarrassed, you know, you talk to people. Hey, you got up, a nose here. And they do it great out there, so we'll have the information up on our screen, but they're only they say they're only doing brows. No nose. I was trying to convince John to maybe you know he's got facial hair right now. <laughs> if you could, could call